So one of the ways that governments, uh, city governments, have used to try to make sure that this flight doesn't happen is to subsidize, to make the new space, but then to subsidize that new space for housing, you know, capital A affordable housing, or for like sushi space next door for this, you know, continued subsidized rent for an arts organization. What do you think of that approach? Do you think that gets us to the goal that you're describing? I mean, it can help. Uh, it, it can definitely help. Although you, you sometimes do see these perverse uh, impacts. I mean, I, I know again in, in my hometown, there's a, a building that we, we have a new set of regulations that's uh, called inclusionary zoning uh, regulations. And the idea is to say, well, when you put up a, a big new development, you have to set some of the housing aside for, for lower income people. Um, and so only one building has actually come up under these new rules. And it has, it's, it's a condo building. And so it has two sort of inclusionary zoning set aside units in it. And they can't sell the units. Uh, the reason they can't sell the units is that low income people can't get the loans that they would need uh, to get the units. Um, and so right now, th that's not helping anyone, right? Uh, it, it was, you know, trying to serve this idea, but it, but it didn't quite work out. Uh, but more broadly, I think that what any city needs to look at is not just a question of, is a certain share of the population going to be low income and, and quote unquote affordable, but in the aggregate, how many people are going to be able to afford to come here? You need to produce, uh, I think, not just affordable housing, but adequate housing. Um, and something that you see particularly in California is that you have a lot of uh, you know, fairly politically liberal jurisdictions that try to do good things in this regard, but that also have, a, I would say, just a real taste for regulation. Um, and so you you just you simply don't see the production of very much new housing in coastal California. So even if some of that is set aside as quote unquote affordable, still not that many people can afford to come.